secrets. What I'm about to tell you is gonna be the craziest thing that you ever heard. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy. I am back with another video. Make sure y'all just check the live that I just made on episode two takeaways and the breakdowns from what kind of happened. You feel me? I'm going to be going live after every episode, I promise y'all, just like I did for book two, season three. Today's live, we've had 30 viewers. It's only episode two. I expect the viewers to keep increasing the more you guys know that I'm actually going live. You feel me? So go tune in. I'm going to be live after every episode. Now, let's get into this. Now, the season three, episode three trailer for Raising Canaan has came out and then we get a little sneak peek so as we all remember in episode two today you feel me um detective howard and rock have a conversation detective howard finally tells rock like yo he basically shows the rock that he still has his memory he tells rock that kanan can't shoot for shit which kind of tells her like yo that he remembers everything that had happened that night and he tells her his biggest mistake was trusting her to tell Kanan that he was the father. Now he's now he's not going to do that no more. Now, like Detective Howard, he says, yo, I want to do it myself now. That was my mistake for thinking that you would actually go tell him. You feel me? So now we see in episode three's little trailer, we have a little snippet. And I showed y'all before I start talking, I showed y'all the clip of Detective Howard's telling Kanan, yo, I'm about to tell you some crazy ass shit. You feel me? So do y'all think he's about to tell Kanan that he's the father? It's probably the scene where he tells Kanan that he's the dad. Now, this is going to fuck Rock up. I know Rock tried to do everything in her power to prevent this. And now remember, in this episode 2-2, two, two, Rock tells Kanan, like, yo, Kanan asks her, he sees that Rock is not, is not acting like herself. Then he asks her, what's bugging you? She says, that cop again. Then she basically tells Kanan, yo, if that cop ever comes to you and says anything, it's a bunch of made up bullshit. Don't believe it. It's not true. Basically trying to protect herself and, and, and trying to hide Kanan from the truth. I just don't know why Rock can't just let Kanan find out who his real father is. So now the question is, will Kanan actually believe Detective Howard when he once he tells him that? Would Kanan actually believe him? Because Rock is about to tell him. Rock is telling Kanan that what's coming out of his mouth is jibbery jabberish. That his mind is all fucked up. His mind is all twisted. So he's just making shit up to fuck their family up, which is not true. And we all know how Kanan takes Rock's word. Will he take Rock's word again? You feel me? And Rock doesn't realize by doing all of this shit, it's kind of building her away from her son. It's kind of messing their relationship up, man. Kanan has to finally step up and realize, yo... Everything that's coming out of his mother's mouth is not the truth. And you can kind of see it gradually happening. She keeps saying, yo, I'm trying to protect you. I'm trying to protect you. But Kanan is, is starting to realize that it's a bunch of bullshit. Because why would you send me on that mission? Knowing I was a rookie. I understand I wanted to be in the game. But you sent me on that mission to protect yourself. You feel me? So we're going to kind of see how this goes down. What do y'all think is going to happen? But it's your boy. I'm out, man. Hit that like button and subscribe.